the fuck is up, Pop Culture Asylum? <clears throat> Coming at you today with John Wick, Six Scale from Hot Toys. I've been waiting on this fucking figure for a long time. And he does not disappoint. He's got a basic ass cool blue box. I mean, it's cool because I used to have a truck, hot rod truck I built that was this color blue. That's basically it. John Wick top, John Wick bottom. Basic bubble window. Got the markers on the sides. Not that exciting of a box. But, the figure makes up for it. He's got accessories oh plenty. Got the combat shotgun. The slide on the side works. Exposes gold metal. You see that little shotgun shell on there? The figure actually comes with three of them little bastards. But only one will clip in the gun. So I'm assuming it's because they're so small, they're like, you're going to lose them, so we'll give you three. He also comes with an AR-15. Nothing worked. Well, yeah, the stock goes in and out. The magazine comes out. It's got a clip so you can put them upside down on each other for the speed flip. You know what I'm saying? And it has exposed rounds in there. Got a little night vision on the side there. A little green window you can see through. It's night vision. Oh shit, what's that? So this goes in and out. Whatever the fuck that is. I don't know if that's too... I don't know what that is, dude. But it goes in and out. Something on the top there. It's got a little writing on it that I cannot read. You would have to... Maybe get a magnifying glass to read it. He's got a Glock 45. Slide goes back. It's got a gold barrel. That's cool. It's got a removable magazine with an exposed bullet. It also has a little writing on it. That I couldn't even begin to tell you what it says. He's got the matching 9mm. Got the gold barrel. Little writing. Just like the 45. It's a matching set. Exposed bullet in the magazine. Classic Hot Toys. He's got, yeah, there, a Desert Eagle with a suppressor on it. Slide with a black barrel. This one's all blacked out. I think, yeah, yeah. Got a magazine with an exposed round. So there's that. He's got the auto shotgun with the night vision window in it. Yeah, that moves. That front handle moves. It looks like, yep, yeah, it can come completely off. Also, the strap on the AR can pop off of it 
and pop right onto here. It just clips on and off. He's got this little wooden box. And the little latch works. Let's open it up. Oop, to reveal another 45 with two silver magazines. I'm assuming that means the barrel when you slide it back is silver. Yeah. Another Glock, but this time with the silver. And it doesn't have all the writing on it like the other one. And those magazines come out and go in the handle. And here's my favorite accessory. The fucking pencil. I don't know if you can see it or not. You can probably see it better. The black background. I mean, it looks just like a number two pencil. But here's the first thing I found wrong with the figure. You cannot, he can't hold the fucking pencil. The best way I figured it out was like this. You can hold the pencil like a fucking cigarette. There's no hand that you can put the fucking pencil in. Which is bullshit. He also comes with the switchblade. It doesn't go in and out or anything. It does have a little clip on it where you could clip it to his pants or whatever if you wanted to, I guess. I don't know why you would. There's more. This is, I told you, this son of a bitch has some accessories, man. It's got the marker. Looks just like, you know, the symbol on the box with the skull and what have you. He's also got an open marker where you can see the bloody fingerprint inside of it. Which, I guess that's cool. An open marker. And I don't know why you wouldn't just make one that opened, but what ifs. You see the stack of gold coinage? He comes with three of these stacks. And then five loose coins. And I didn't even bother because I knew you wouldn't be able to see the damn loose ones. If I did bust him out. Now, he has ten hands. He has a right handshake hand. A right pistol hand. A right knife hand. A right fist. And then a right rifle hand. Okay, we'll start with the left. He's got a left gun hand, pistol hand. He's got a left knife hand. All the left hands also have the trademark wedding ring. He's got a left barrel holding hand. He's got a left handshake hand. He's got a left pistol hand. And then I already showed you the left rifle hand. The stand is the basic U with the uh, marker symbol painted on it. It says John Witt right there. Now for the figure, man, I think the head sculpt is great. I wish it would have been rooted, 
but it's not but it's a good looking head regardless got a little blood on there the hair looks great Oop, foot. even though you know it's not rooted the suit is great I'll use my classic just like somebody drops some pin particles on a damn Armani He's got, you know, it's nice and aligned. The vest has got magnets in it. So you can open it up and expose the nice dress shirt and the tie. The tie is actually tied on there, like a real tie. It's got a nice pleather belt with a faux uh, metal buckle. It all looks like it works. I like the touch with, to where you can open the vest with the magnets. That's a nice touch. He's got the nice dress shoes on. But here's the second thing that's wrong with this fucking figure. This may be something on a lot of Hot Toys I've just never noticed. What the fuck are those ankles, man? What the fuck are those ankles? Look at that shit. What the fuck are you trying to pull with these fucking ankles, man? Where's the rest of his goddamn leg? So you definitely, he's got wankles. Where the fuck are the ankles? Wankles. So you have to be careful with your displaying him. Make sure that the suit, you know, the pants are pulled over there nice and tight so you can't see the exposed fucking wankles throw them in a nice pose here and I'll let y'all guess what do you think is the third thing I'll keep that pencil in there what do you think the third thing I noticed about this figure is no motherfucking dog where's the fucking dog hot toys I would have paid extra for a fucking deluxe if it came with the fucking dog, man. What, why no dog? Other than that, man, there he is. Hot Toys, six scale wick. I'm giving him an evil nine out of ten. Would have been a ten out of ten had he had a dog, a hand that holds the fucking pencil, and he didn't have wankles. Give me a like. Subscribe. Until next time. Show me some motherfucking toys.